removing and transporting students from their local school? Okay, well, I think the wrong answer is getting rid of our neighborhood schools. Okay? And that's where I talk about when I talk about biggest bang for the buck. Your biggest bang for the buck is not stuffing 600 kids into one elementary school. That's not the biggest bang for your buck. The biggest bang for your buck is keeping them in our neighborhood schools where the teachers, the principal, and the whole staff knows your child. And your child grows in their neighborhood and with that same staff that stays a boy. Josh made another good mention, you know, about our buildings. And we're gonna replace some of these buildings built in the 60s and 70s fairly soon. Well, you look at the new schools in the South End, and boy, they look really nice. I wonder how much we paid the architect to design that. But if you look at every other elementary school that was built around the turn of the century in the 1900s, they all look the same. Thank you, Mr. Oliveira. Mr. Porter? Well, again, that, that is also a priority, is how do we deal with our aging facilities? Um, so we need to also work with our community in saying what's the best way for us to make it a priority for them. We need to lobby the, the Mass School Building Authority so that we can get new buildings. 